vitals and body tissues. From this activity, um, I have learned about um, the structures of the cell and the part of the cell and its function. So some parts of the cells is the centrioles, ribosomes, chromatin, cytoskeleton, cytosol, cytoplasm, Golgi apparatus, and many more. And I, I have learned uh, their parts so far. Also, um, in this topic, um, we have um, learned about the diffusion of dye. Um, we are asked to um, observe about the diffusion of dye through the agar um, gel. So we have the methylene blue in, at room temperature, temperature and um, potassium permanganate. So um, from these two, uh, methylene blue has um, the higher molecular weight and the potassium permanganate has the lower mo molecular weight so thus the potassium permanganate um, diffuse rap rapidly than the uh, methylene blue and um, its radius is um, a bit bigger compared to the methylene blue so, so um, I have learned about the um, effect of salt concentrate on osmosis so in this we have three types of um, tonicity um the hypertonic isotonic and hypotonic so in hypertonic just like this one in the hypertonic um the all of the water from the blood cells is transported outside while in the isotonic there are a balance so as the water goes in the water also goes out from the cell so it has a natural size um, the cell swells and eventually bursts is because um, the water only goes inside the cell and as it goes inside the cell the cell expands and swells and if it if it cannot take any more water it will burst salt concentration for the hypertonic is 5% isotonic is 0.9 and 0% for the salt concentration okay um, also, we have, um, we draw the um, different body tissue types, so um, I will show you my work. So, this is the lanceolated um, columnar epithelium from epithelial cells, the, skele the skeletal muscle fiber from skeletal muscle tissues, um, the mesenchyme, mucous connective tissues, the areolar connective tissues, the adipose, uh, the fibrocartilage, the hyaline cartilage, the elastic cartilage, and the osteocytes, the reticular connective, the dense regular connective, the dense irregular connective, and the elastic connective tissues. So all of this um, came from the mature connective tissues. Uh, we have the simple squamous um, epithelium, the simple cuboidal epithelium, the um, non keratinized stratified column um, squamous epithelium, and the stratified um, cuboidal epithelium, and lastly, um, the, the neuron of spinal cord from the nervous system, the connective tissues. The stratified columnar epithelium and the relaxed transitional epithelium. So these are the 22 um, uh, tissues from the body that we have uh, drawn. So as we go in this blood, in this, uh, yeah, in this blood, uh, we are asked to do some experiment in our house with our family. So I have asked my mother and my father to help me. In this um, in this project so I have my father as the first one to stop the timer and my mother to be in the um, in the um, corner of the room so he holds she holds the last uh, the last stopwatch okay so from this activity I sprayed the perfume and it took time for the for my father to smell it so uh, when the time comes that he smelled the perfume, he would stop the um, the time and wait until my mom um, 
smell it smells the fragrance too so um, in this type of uh, experimentation or activity i i have learned about the simple diffusion in which the simple diffusion the particles from the um, highly concentrated area moves to the lower concentrated area and without um, releasing any energy so it is the simple diffusion box and i have heard that this simple diffusion is uh palagi nating uh na parang na encounter in our daily life without even noticing it so um, when we smell the the fragrant of of um, our mother's um, cooking the fragrant of the perfume the diffusion of the um, smoke outside our houses and uh, many more it is called simple diffusion and it is um, used in our daily life without us noticing it so in my reflection um, I want to reflect this as a Christian uh, same as um, as we hold the belief and we believe in God we spread the gospel and that is our mission so as a Christian we must diffuse or we must spread the gospel to those who needs it to the people who, um, who is seeking for the truth so from from our church we should go out reach out and spread the gospel to those um, who doesn't even know God and um, who wants to know him more that's all Thank you.